Well, what a lovely, lovely day. Absolutely glorious weather here as we welcome you to a football match of considerable significance, great consequence. It looks as though we're going to have a great turnout, such as being the level of enthusiasm generated once the fixture was announced. There is still movement in the crowd, plenty of people yet to take their seats. The roads outside are very, very busy, particularly around this time of day. Well, there are plenty looking forward to seeing this, a capacity crowd here. Well, with nothing resting on this, Peter, I'm hoping that there'll be more impetus for the players to just enjoy the game with, with the pressure off, try out a few different things, and we get something open and free-flowing. So we're up and running. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Yeah, David Alaba. One of the most versatile players out there. He's just got so much positional awareness and intelligence. He can basically do a job anywhere on this pitch. He's got fabulous technique too, especially with his delivery in and around the area. He'll be eyeing up any set plays the opposition concede in that defensive third. <laughs> I wonder whether that has anything to do with you being a defender once upon a time, Jim. Gets away from his opponents. There's the shot! Good try. The outcome could so easily have been different. Uh, that's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. Lima. Austria playing here with a nice expansive style. Yeah, with their fullbacks making up the numbers in attack too, just need to make sure the back line doesn't become too stretched and face with too much ground to cover. And that's gone behind for a goal kick. David Klassen. Frimpol. Simons. So a third of the match or thereabouts gone, and we still await the first goal. Coop Miners. Can he put it away? Has a shot! And that's caused a worry or two. Coop Miners just denied by a lick of paint. We're talking centimetres. Linhart. Massive leap! Good try. The outcome could so easily have been different. Uh, that's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. Lima. Austria playing here with a nice expansive style. Yeah, with their fullbacks making up the numbers in attack too. Just need to make sure the back line doesn't become too stretched and face with too much ground to cover. 
And that's gone behind for a goal kick. David Klassen. Frimpol. Simons. So a third of the match or thereabouts gone, and we still await the first goal. Coop Miners. Can he put it away? Has a shot. And that's caused a worry or two. Coop Miners just denied by a lick of paint. We're talking centimetres. Hart. It's run loose here. Now it's Memphis to pie. Simmons. He's in a good shape to shoot. And another time. Goal, the Netherlands. And it's the Netherlands who take the lead. Sharp, simple, satisfying. He just knew what was on. Well, I admire players who do that because they just don't give up on anything. The Netherlands take the lead. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Lima. Now it's Memphis Depay. Simons. A real chance to break. Good spot. He's seen the run. Stefan de Vrij. Now Simons. And if you have just joined us, still just one goal between them. And the score is 1-0. That's a modern defender's instinct from a, a modern coach's mindset. Now it's Memphis Depay. And the shot! Oh, he's managed to get it all wrong. Simons deserves a lot of credit for his willingness to make those runs. The passers will always have an option with him. And this could be the final action of the first half. And he's managed to get rid. Referee's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. Steady, solid, and for now, where they want...